sharpness three, you know, on a shovel, you know, it's doable. It's a thing that you can, oh. Hello guys, this is Spider Rock, and welcome to the More Gear Minecraft add-on 1.17 update, also known as the Even More update, is I think what I'm gonna call it. Anyway, if you don't know already, More Gear is my add-on that adds in four new sets of like end or late game armor, uh, tools, and weapons that you can get in more interesting ways than just mining more ores. But this update adds four more new sets of gear for you to check out, um, and most of these are aimed for like early to mid game. Uh, so you can have kind of a, a full expansion of, of new gears and things. By the way, I just released some music, and if you like what you hear in the background of this video, you can check it out using the link in the description. Anyway, I want to hop right into this. I have a chest down here, so here's all the stuff that already existed. If you didn't uh, know, this is this is everything that it adds. Um, there is a link in the description, not all this up here, this is just normal stuff, but there is a link in the description also where you can uh, watch a video about these and how to get them. Today's video is going to be on this new stuff here which i'm going to show you what they are what they do what their benefits are and how you get them so i'm going to hop into survival uh i didn't i just put game mode game mode s there we go okay so the first new little set of things which this is kind of an expansion two of them are just uh, one of them's just armor one of them's just uh just weapons and the other two but these all have like kind of special traits and stuff so anyway wooden armor so now instead of having to to get leather and stuff and waste it on armor uh and you know what i normally do is i just don't use our armor until i find like iron uh now there's wood armor you make wood armor out of logs instead of planks i thought planks would have been probably way too like cheap and overpowered and i feel like uh logs are a fair trade-off and you make it just like normal armor this is slightly less durable and is not enchantable so if i go into this enchantment table here slightly less durable not enchantable uh when compared to la uh, leather armor so you know it's a really good early game armor just gives you like four and a three and a half armor bars of of armor and it i i think it looks kind of nice i mean i didn't do the best job on the little item textures but you know it works it serves its purpose you can run around with it you can uh you fight things off with it let me give myself let's give at p here we go i got a wood sword so i can fight off some of these guys and you can see the kind of uh, damage reduction it does which you know it's is ultimately not going to be that impactful but it's like wearing leather armor i think it might break by the end of this or it might be close to breaking i think most of them only have like 50 or less hit points so i mean you're gonna probably you're gonna probably lose this armor pretty quickly but you know it's made out of logs uh so it, you can also use any type of log i modeled it after oak because i feel like that's going to be the one that most people use um but hey this sword is going to break first i don't know this is kind of annoying okay i wish i had a better sword on me uh oh there's a lot of guys and these guys have better armor than i do well you know we're just going to call it a win uh let me go grab another sword let's see yeah my armor is already like starting to break pretty pretty a lot i mean i guess it, i think it i honestly i made it i made it so that you can't enchant it because i feel like one that would be a little bit powerful but two uh by the time that you have an enchantment table you're probably going to start having some iron gear and you're probably going to like if you look i throw on this leather it's going to be a little bit different but um there's no point in really enchanting things this early in the game i mean you could like enchant your leather stuff but like i don't know why you'd want to but the woods there is like the alternative to leather i mean it won't even come enchanted anywhere if you find it like yeah but yep that's it that's the wooden armor let's uh let's move on to the next thing down here actually just uh just for reference see just to prove that you can use any type of log to craft it i can go in here and i can craft wooden armor but i can also craft it with uh with say dark oak if i wanted to see so you can use you can use pretty much any log i don't think you can use the like fancy i should probably should make should have made a recipe for like the nether woods but you know if you're in the nether that you have other problems to worry about i'll probably do that later anyway the next set of gear here is the copper gear so copper gear is essentially an alternative to iron so copper is just about as good as diamond in terms of the amount of protection it gives you and how good the tools and weapons are however it's slightly less durable than iron and yet again you can't enchant it that's going to be a theme kind of throughout is that this is going to be an alternative for just getting the things you want 
and not having to worry about enchanting, but also not being able to get the benefits of enchanting. Like it's gonna be the equivalent of having like sharpness one or efficiency one on your iron tools or having like protection one on your iron armor, but you can't really expand it past that. I mean, as you can see, I, I think I did an okay job at making it look okay. I, I hope I did. I think it looks all right personally, but it's just kind of like a retextured version of iron. And as you can see, the stuff will break pretty quickly. It's not as flimsy as something like gold, but it definitely is still very flimsy and like I said it's just as good as diamond otherwise so like in terms of protection you get a full full thing of armor you get like a decent seven damage sword but then again you can't enchant it which now since 1.17 enchanting has been a pretty important thing I think especially with things like having fortune on a pickaxe is actually something you're probably going to want much earlier game like normally before 1.17 I wouldn't enchant a pickaxe at all or like an iron pickaxe I would wait until I have a diamond one at least um, but nowadays you'll probably want fortune uh, which you can't get on a copper pickaxe however you get the mining speeds also I, I, I want to mention everything all the tools and items have been updated for 1.17 so they can break all the all the new blocks and things um, but yeah you can break copper with copper uh, and it's gonna I don't know why the uh, why the breaking durability isn't going down that seems to be a bit of an issue but that's probably that's probably just one of the buggy things with add-ons right now but uh, anyway maybe it's just the copper block kind of thing I don't really know but you can see it's starting to, to break a little bit a little bit faster than iron probably would and uh, you can't enchant it which you could with iron so uh, there's that and then just to prove to you that you can make all the things if we hop into here copper gear copper weapons and tools all pretty simple pretty simple stuff uh, let me go ahead and move on to the next thing by clearing my inventory and the next set of items here is obsidian so obsidian is kind of like the upgrade from copper obsidian is an alternative to diamond and you get just about as good as iron gear so it's kind of like the uh, the anti the anti copper let me do a slash kill to reset my hunger uh it's kind of like the anti copper except so yeah it's not as good as uh not as good as diamond it's just about as good as iron and you can't enchant obsidian either however it's insanely durable everything here has double the durability of diamond so like with diamond look like a diamond pickaxe or something has like 1500 durability this has 3000 durability so you could get this stuff and you could not have to like really think about about having to repair it or anything for a long time plus you don't technically I mean also the other advantage it has knockback resistance the armor you can uh, you can just resist all the knockback in your obsidian armor it's pretty I'm getting swarmed okay let me get out of here um, but yeah it's got knockback resistance and a ton of durability however you can't enchantment enchantment you cannot enchant it and it's not as good as uh, not as good as diamond at least in the aspect of like damage and mining speed and protection and things like that. But you know, if you don't want to worry about having to repair anything or having to get mending or enchanting anything, and you just want a set of gear that's going to last you for a long time, maybe you want to have a sword that you specifically use or say something like a mob farm where you maybe already have like strength potions or something and you just have one want, want a sword that's not going to break at all and you don't want it to be that expensive you don't want to waste your diamonds or your netherite on a uh, on a sword or a pickaxe that you want to just use for an afk farm same thing goes with like shovels and axes axe maybe for a tree farm or something like one of those uh, automatic tree farms or armor that you can just throw on look pretty snazzy and i'm not gonna lie i like the look of this stuff i think it looks pretty cool um and then just kind of forget about it you know it gives you a decent amount of protection um and this is kind of like in the middle between iron and diamond because i mean you do get that nice knockback resistance before netherite and you could theoretically find obsidian like village chests and stuff and you just wouldn't really have to worry about about getting iron or diamond separately so if you do find that obsidian if you do get lucky with that then you could probably craft this stuff and be pretty good i mean it's kind of like i don't know it, it's a unique thing and so I'm, I'm just trying something new here pretty much um and just to prove it to you again you can craft all of these things with obsidian and uh, just like the regular crafting recipes just like that and then finally, the last set of gear here is Lapis Gear. So Lapis Gear is also kind of unique. It has generally low durability, and it's not really meant to be an alternative too much. It's kind of meant to be its own thing if you want it. So this stuff is just about as good as iron. I think it even has the durability maybe of iron. But the, the thing you can do with this, the, the cool thing you can do is let's say, let's say, hold on, I need to get some Lapis from down here so I can, uh, I can enchant this stuff. Here we go. So the interesting thing about the Lapis Gear is that you can put any 
enchantment, any tool enchantment on the lapis tools. So let's say I wanted a silk touch sword. Also, by the way, it's extremely enchantable. So level one enchant gave me a Bane of Arthropods five, Unbreaking three, and silk touch one. So now you can have your silk touch sword. I don't know, can you silk touch? No, you can't, I don't know why I did that. But you can silk touch grass, you can kind of do whatever. So the way I did this, I'm gonna be honest, if uh, axes can pretty much be enchanted with any tool enchantment. So I gave them all the enchantable tag of axes. So if you want to have, say, a pickaxe with, uh, I don't know, Bane of Arthropods or something, hold on, slash give a P. So now I can hop into here and throw some enchantments on some of my other things. So for example, you know, if I want a, say, Bane of Arthropods 5, Silk Touch 1, Efficiency 5 pickaxe, I can do that with the Lapis pickaxe. So, you know, this could actually be decent, especially on a pickaxe. You could throw maybe a fortune and like Bane of Arthropods or something on it. And then if you want to go explore, say, a mine shaft, and you know there's going to be cave spiders, you don't even have to swap to a sword. You can just be mining, spider, bam, 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 and then keep mining. Let me see if I can get smite on a shovel. Is that a thing I could do? Well, that is a thing I could do, but I can also uh, conveniently get sharpness three on my shovel. So if you want to have a shovel that does six attack damage and it's not too expensive, plus like Lapis, this is super easy to get so I, I can have a sharpness 3 shovel and I can beat these guys up with my sharpness 3 shovel look at this a shovel is going to be just as effective as a sword a sharpness 3 you know on a shovel you know it's doable it's a thing that you can oh so yeah I don't know why you would necessarily want to want to do any of this stuff but if you do want to do any of this stuff, this is a thing that you can do now with these lapis tools. And I mean, yeah, like I said, pretty low durability, but you know, you get, it, it's a tool made of lapis. Lapis is pretty easy to get. You get a lot of lapis. So if you need a tool instantly that you can kind of throw whatever on, you could just say, grab a pickaxe, see if I can get, ah, I'm being chased down by these guys. Okay, can I craft myself? Here we go, a lapis pickaxe. I want to see if I can throw, uh, if I can throw sharpness on this lapis pickaxe. Let's see, is sharpness an option here? Okay, uh, sharpness is an option. Let's see, sharpness three, fortune two. So my pickaxe currently does seven damage because I threw sharpness, what is it, sharpness three on it. So, you know, it's it's pretty interesting. I feel like if you want to go caving and you want to just have a, uh, a good weapon, plus, I mean, like you can you can mine things quick and whatever. It's, it's not the best pickaxe but you know sharpness three on a pickaxe that's that's a thing anyway thanks for watching if you made it to here if you did in fact make it to here which most people don't comment down below uh sharpness pickaxe because i feel like that's that's relevant enough to this uh, anyway i'm gonna I, I, I was gonna rate my add-on out of 10 i'm gonna give my add-on a 10 out of 10 because it's my add-on and i made it anyway you can download this in the description it'll take you back to the original video and in the description of that video is the download to the updated version um i will be posting Posting this on or updating this on MCPDL pretty soon. I just kind of have to wait for it to go through. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you guys later and bye.